Ladies and gentlemen, the Samsung Platform Evangelist team. And I'm very glad and honored to be here to introduce Bada 2.0 to you in Bangalore here in India. It is worth noting that the Bangalore is the city where we have the first Bada Developer Day last year, just after releasing the first Bada device, Wave. And we are now here again for you to have a first Bada Developer Day 2011 just after releasing the BADA 2.0 SDK. So I think, I think most of you already heard about this BADA SDK release news. And some of you may download the SDK already. As you can see, the BADA SDK 2.0 has many features. We have more than 3,000 APIs, which is added in this new SDK. And we have more than 50 new features in this new SDK. The BADA SDK has evolved, BADA platform is evolved so that it enables to make more powerful and wonderful applications. So I'd like to briefly introduce the major features of the BADA SDK. First, we added many enriched features that enables you to make more diversified applications. And second, it is we have a very good news for the Flash and web developers. We make it much easier for Flash and web developers to make BADA applications now. So the device users, uh, BADA device users can enjoy more attractive Flash and web applications. Third, we also provide many useful development tools which will substantially support you in developing your applications. And finally, we also made many methods that will bring you more uh, revenue and help your business. So let's take a look for each item in the prepared slides. First, BADA 2.0 uh, support uh, multitasking among the BADA applications. And this is very good news for the device users. And it also means that users can more likely use your applications on BADA devices. And Wi-Fi Direct, through the Wi-Fi Direct, I think the more innovative application scenarios are opened up for the developers. For example, you can make an application which communicates with other several devices and exchange the data with a high speed. And NFC, through the NFC, you can make more innovative application which, com which uh, include a convenient mobile payment or ticket reservation and push notification. So with this push no notification, you can announce your important and important news uh, information to your application users directly within the application. And OpenAL, this feature is added to uh, provide a compelling, uh, compelling sound experience for game or multimedia central applications. And um, we also extend the coverage, so it is very good news for the Flash and web developers. If you are JavaScript developers, you are now very easy to make a BADA application through the BADA JavaScript framework. So BADA 2.0 gives access to approximately 300 JavaScript APIs. And some of these APIs are for the BADA application lifecycle, and some of them are for the UI. So your application have a similar look and feel as the TouchWiz UI, which is properly designed for touchscreen smartphone. And it is also compatible with the WAC 2.0 standard. So your device, your, you can also access the device features like sensors and the calendar or the address book with the standardized web technologies. And for uh, a broader range of the support of HTML5 functions combined with this JavaScript framework API, it is now able to develop more powerful web applications. And also the support of the Flash is also improved, and it is possible to make a personalized lock screen with Flash. Okay, let's talk about the development tools now. And 
it's very important for you. And I believe that these useful development tools will be giving you a helping hand. First, Vada 2.0 gives a provides an emulator that shows a similar and same behavior as the as the hard, real hardware device. So it minimizes the well-known problem between between uh, problem simulator device behavior discrep discrepancy. So it means that invest less time in tuning your application. So then you can make more you can make your application more easily and more quickly. And we also provide a profiler and that makes you to check your bottleneck of your application. And the performance analyzer is for the, the check your the application usage, resource usage, like a file, database, and memory. And we believe that these tools will substantially help to optimize your applications. And last but not least, the, you, this, we also increase the business opportunity for you. So this is a very important topic for so. And Vada 2.0 uh, support the uh, ads, so in-app apps. You can insert the advertisement in your application with a few lines of Vada 2.0 ad APIs. And we also provide a uh, uh, operating billing for in-app purchase. So your application's user now uh, conveniently buy the many items while enjoying your applications. And to make uh, appealing, to make more appealing your application to the device users, Samsung Apps provides many useful methods so the user can try your application more often. Uh, for example, the device user can use your application for a given period, given trial period, and purchase it later on. Okay, I think this support, I believe that these features will help to help your business and increase your profit. So, we've seen main features of the Vada 2.0, and I'd like to talk about the device right now. So, in last year, we launched the first Vada device, Wave, and including this Wave device, Samsung has launched a total of seven devices uh, within the Wave series, and all these devices are based on Vada platform. And these devices are distributed all over the world, more than 100 countries. And I'd like to share here, Vada device sales data, and it shows that the uh, Vada device has mainly sold in Europe. In the top list of the countries, uh, Vada device sales, European countries like uh, France, Germany, Italy, and Poland are include, included. And also, the devices uh, sold a lot in Asia, including China and India. It also sold a lot in Russia. So please keep in mind this data and please make your application visible to the countries where the Vada device is popular. Okay, so Samsung is now focusing on growing the Vada market size further with this Vada 2.0 equipped device. So recently, Samsung has announced the launch of Wave 3, Wave M, and Wave Y. You can, uh, you can enjoy this device over there, and experience John. And Wave 3 is the, is the hero modem with a 1.4 gigahertz processor, and we have a super clear AMOLED display. And Wave M, Wave Y, is supposed to have a HVGA resolution. It has 832 processor. I expect this Wave M and Wave Y will sold a lot more countries compared to the Wave 3, with a competitive price. I think with these uh, models introduced to the market, we expect that sales of 10 million units will be easily accomplished in this year. And with, the device, with this device, uh, all improved UX and services are provided. I'd like to show you a little bit about this improved UX and uh, services. So. You can easily show, uh, find out the improvement of the UX through the home screen. This uh, contains a lot of dynamic and convenient elements like uh, dynamic folder creation and application shortcut and direct access. And library panel is also in, uh, included. So with this library panel, you can customize a setup for the useful content like weather, 
news, stocks, and more real-time services. And all the data devices now, you can have a new service chat on. This Samsung new service chat on is a chatting, chatting service, so that enables you to find your friends more easily with the integration of the phone book. And this chat on service will be supported in Android and iOS in addition to the other platform. You can also find the improvement in the Find My Mobile services, which is very useful for when you lost your device. And we also provide many good methods for the Samsung apps, which will help your business. And I believe that all of these features will be loved by the many device, use, device users. And that makes more expansion of the Wave series. Okay, the Samsung apps service is most important for the smartphone. So to grow within the uh, smartphone, smartphone platform market, it's very, it's very important to expand the uh, application ecosystem. So Samsung Apps is now growing rapidly. So now its service can be provided in more than 120 countries. And paid application can be sold in 47 countries. And we are trying to make more expand this coverage further. And you can, you can get the service in many more countries. In addition to the coverage, we, the sales is also increased. So in the last uh, March, uh, Samsung Apps exceeded 1 million download. And I'd like to show the download data here. USA is not mentioned in the list of countries. Pardon? America, USA. Uh, actually, the Wave series is not uh, inserted in the US market yet. Okay. Yes, only for the Canada. And and for the application downloads, uh, it is very closely related to the uh, device sales data. And you can see uh, uh, application downloads occurs a lot in Europe and Asia compared to the other countries. Actually, the highest application downloads occurs in France and followed by the India. And uh, um, yes, yeah. And please uh, give a, uh, keep in mind to show your application in these countries. Okay, uh, we are, Samsung Apps has now uh, more than 15,000 applications now, our applications now, and we are working together with a lot of company and developers for Bata 2.0. Uh, we, all hope, we all hope you and more countries and companies and developers join to the Bata world. We will do our best not only to increase the competitiveness of Bata platform, but also increase your business and profit. So we have a plan to expand Bada 2.0 with uh, several activities. Starting from this Bangalore Bada Developer Day, we have a plan to have a more Developer Day in other countries like China, UK, and Russia, and other countries. We also have a plan to have a Developer Change Program encourage you to develop more attractive applications. So please check these events. And again, we also pl plan to have a global application contest named Bada 2.0 Power App Race. And this is the second, uh, second uh, global contest we have last year. And we are preparing, preparing total 3 million prize. So please check this contest. And we will uh, announce more detailed information in the website later. And dear developers in India, I really, I especially thank you. I would like to say thank you to all of you because you're giving us so deep, a special interest in Pada. So uh, India is a high link, highly linked on developer side. The first number of members at developer side, and second number of sec, uh, SDK download, and third largest number of seller registered at developer side. I, mean, I know, seller side. So I really thank you, all of you, and ask you to have a more continuous, deep interest in Pada. I've heard that Pada means big and great in Hindi. Is my pronunciation okay for you, Pada? <laughs> Pada is also means for Korean, uh, ocean in Korean. So we are, we are going to try our best to make the Pada as a big, 
blue ocean for you. I think we truly believe that the success of Bada platform is your success too. And I'd like to conclude this session with this phrasing. We started with the Bada. So we are going to make Bada as a bestowing more freedom on developers and accredited developer support, dedicated developer service, and always putting developers first. So I'd like to recommend to shout all is well as Bada. Thank you. Thank you.